at Whirlwind, we feel that we are the innovators. We are the people that create the product from scratch. We come up with new ideas. We, we're the pioneers of, of the product line. And because of that, we have a philosophy that for the last 32 years we have not changed. And the philosophy is build a good product and build it consistent. And if there's a component or part out there that we don't like or we think we can make better, we build it ourselves. We build our own multi-pins. We design and build our own XLR connectors. We design and build our own chassis and boxes. If, if it's not available and we can't find it and it's not good enough that it already exists, we create it ourselves. And that's what makes us different. Every time you pick up a piece of Whirlwind, you can hold it in your hand and you know it came only from Whirlwind. That's our commitment. Well, the first NAMM show we went to, we bought a couple import guitars with us that were made in uh, Europe. We also bought a couple guitar chords with us. Remember, yeah, Steve? I remember that. For three days in Chicago, it was back in 1975. Uh, no one wanted to talk to us about the guitars, but they wanted to talk to us about the guitar and chords. And we had a beautiful display of guitars. Yeah. And all they cared about was that one damn guitar chord that we had. And uh, we ended up selling about 25,000 of them in three days. And uh, I remember sitting in the car driving home going, well, I guess we're a guitar chord factory. <laughs> products that we made in the early days were basically products that I had uh, made myself for the use in a uh, recording studio. We had a little recording studio up in our, uh, near our factory up on Whitney Street. And uh, we made our own direct boxes, we made our own patch cables, and we made our own little snakes to get in and out of the control room. Because we have the ability to do cable and wiring, complete metal shop fabrication, and circuit board design and creation and population, we can create any types of products that range in the audio business from cabling to uh, flat panel chassis to custom electronics. Our custom shop capabilities are second to none. We tackle all kinds of challenges that people give us ranging from electronics to custom metal to wiring and fabrications. So it was about two and a half years that we worked on the Bellagio and it was a job that I can, you know, I didn't ever think would end. We had been working on the project for probably about a year and a half, shipping out pallet load after pallet load of equipment to the construction site. We had finally completed the order, and this was about 18 months after the start of the job, when about uh, a, a week later, uh, I got a fax that was a whole new PO that was about twice the size of the original job that we had originally done for the Bellagio, and it was phase two, and it would encompass another year of production, and obviously it turned out to be at that time a state-of-the-art facility in the world, and I'm glad that we were part of it. Whirlwind is a unique community of uh, individuals. Most of us have been in bands or have worked as sound contractors or have worked as roadies or sound men for different uh, bands, different sound companies in the area. Uh, myself, I played uh, professionally for 38 years. Um, Sam, our production uh, manager, uh, still works on weekends doing sound for major acts all over the country. Uh, last weekend he just flew down to uh, New York City and uh, did front of house mixing for a major group. Hesis is our family of digital products. Uh, it's the future of audio transport. It lets us take 560 channels of audio and send it down a single Cat5 or 10 miles on a piece of fiber. Pretty much once we put it in the digital world, we can do whatever we want with it. Customer service. I think that's the most important product that we sell here. The products that we manufacture obviously are what people buy and they're tangible products that they can hold in their hand. But it's really when the phone call is made either before or after a sale that really determines the success of the implementation of that product. We're one Les Paul. It's a very unique story. Back in 1978, 
I was invited to a party down in Maryland. And while I was there, they asked me if I would come in this room, come into another room off the party. I walked into the room, and standing in the room was Les Paul. And uh, they said, well, Les Paul would like to meet you. While I was at MXR, <clears throat> I had sent a complete set of MXR pedals to Les Paul. And when I was at Whirlwind, at the beginning of Whirlwind, I had sent a complete set of Whirlwind cables to Les Paul. I'd always felt that he was the reason for our existence. He was the, he was the father of rock and roll, and then without rock and roll, there would be no music that, as we know it today. And uh, Les Paul looked at me and he said, you know, few people have given me things in life, and you're one of them, and I want to repay it. And uh, he looked at me and said, uh, I went up to my attic, and I had uh, many guitars up in my attic, and I went through a few of them to find a good one, and he handed me this guitar. And uh, I was just totally blown away.